In this tutorial, I'll show you how you can use the square and irregular crop tools to crop an image that you've imported into your PagePlus publication. I'll start with a simple square crop. I'll select my photo, expand the crop tools flyout, and select the square crop tool. If I now hover over these handles that display around the border of my photo, you can see that the cursor changes to the crop cursor. And all I have to do is drag the handles to crop my photo. Notice that if I drag a corner handle, the aspect ratio of the photo is maintained, but if I drag a side handle, I can change the shape of the image. On the context toolbar, the feather setting lets me apply a soft feather edge to the crop outline, and I can click and drag on the photo to reposition it inside the crop area. If I want to remove the crop, I just click the Remove Crop button on the Context Toolbar. Now let's use the Irregular Crop tool. I can quickly switch to this tool by selecting it from the Crop Context Toolbar. Of course, I could also select it from the Crop Flyout. I can now change the shape of my crop outline by manipulating these nodes and the lines that connect them. I can add new nodes by double-clicking on the crop outline. When I click on a node, notice these small handles that display on either side. You can drag these to adjust the curvature of the outline. Notice also that when a node is selected, the Curve Context Toolbar controls become enabled. These let you change the node type, and you can read all about these options in the Page Plus Help. If you want to delete a node, simply select it, and either press the Delete key on your keyboard, or click this Delete button on the Context Toolbar. Again, I can drag on my image to reposition it inside the crop outline, and I can soften the edge of the outline by adjusting the feather value.